Hello World Lock Picking Dev at little Avis 6530. I'm at Vernal Falls in Yosemite National Park. Let's see if I can get an open real quick. I'll show you around before my battery dies. Click on two. Oh, that was one, sorry. Click on two. Go. In the back. On four, three, and there's our open. There we go, Avis 6530. I will not gut that for you. Let me show you around before my battery dies. So this is Vernal Falls. See, there's tons of people. Tons of people. But the pretty part, Vernal Falls and Yosemite National Park. A nice rainbow over it. All right, I'm back home. And so I did decide to gut this. And so we'll see that we notice that it is all standard pen. And one thing to point out too, see if it'll focus here. There you go, that'll focus just enough. And see in the driver pins that um, looks like there's almost little light serrations right there, right there, right there, and right there. But I did check it and I rubbed them and that is not serrated. Uh, that is just, from what it looks like, um, the shear line. So where it sits on top of this pin, this one's probably the other way around like this. And that's probably the shear line right there. And that's probably the way it works. That's probably the other way around as well. But yeah, so uh, I thought that was interesting. I haven't really seen uh, that noticeable appearance come up uh, before from a shear line. And here is our bedding. Focus. There we go. And since I did got it, I wanted to show you it as well. Sorry about this. There we go. And so yeah, here are all the holes on the top. You can see the one, the uh, retaining pin one right there is a little bit offset. Here is the retaining pin right here. It actually, um, there's two retaining pins. There's this one that goes all the way down into the uh, plug right here. And there's an initial one that's kind of like a cap protecting this one. But after you draw out the cap, this one will fall right out. And so here we are, here's our cylinder. And you can see there's our retaining pin hole. Here's our four pin holes. And one thing to point out too, is that the actuator is a single actuator. So this is those types of actuators that you can typically bypass. And I decided to give that a shot and I discovered that that's what these little bars are in the back of these plugs. I've seen these often and I've never understood what they were or why. That's exactly what they're for, I, at least I believe. And tell me if I'm wrong. Because when I try to stick this in, my, my knife tool here on the top, you can see I can't get under. So the actuator is going to sit right here underneath this lip right here. So if I go from the top, that's the bottom, here we go. If I go from the top, I can't get under because of that bar. So I can't get under that to bypass it. And then from the bottom, we'll flip it around. From the bottom either, there's no way to get up underneath that. So yeah, that is not bypassable. If that little bar wasn't there, it would be bypassable. But that is our Abus 6530, and that was Vernal Falls in Yosemite Valley, Yosemite National Park. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching.